Welcome myself Gurmeet Kaur and today I am going to teach phytohormones. You might be wondering what is phytohormones? Phytohormones are plant hormones. Okay? Phytohormones are plant hormones. We have studied the animal hormones. Which hormones? Animal hormones. Now we are going to discuss the plant hormones. They are different types of hormones that work in plant. They are signal molecules. What are they? They are signal molecules. Fine. Now let's see different type of hormones. Number one is oxygen. Number one is oxygen. This is also known as growth hormone. This is also known as growth hormone. You might be have seen that small plants grows to the larger trees, but it helps with the hormones, the growth hormones. Oxygen helps to grow, okay? And it also breaks the seed dormancy. You might be wondering what is seed dormancy? Seed dormancy is when seed breaks and grow as saplings is known as seed dormancy. Oxygen helps in growth and seed dormancy. It also inhibits the lateral growth of the plant. Okay? Lateral growth. It helps in apical growth. Apical growth. Let's see how. This is the plant. This is its apex. Okay. It helps to promote in apical growth. But it inhibits or stops to grow laterally. This is not allowed. Axine does not help in lateral growth. It helps in apical growth. Fine. Let's understand it with the help of diagram. The sun rays falls upon the plant and the auxins which first was present this side moves to the another side. First the auxins were present here. Now it has moved to the opposite side. Now this side becomes the heavier and this side becomes light. Fine. Now the plant tilts towards the lighter side, towards the sun. Okay, this helps the plant to tilt towards the sun. Fine. The next we are studying is gibberlins. Next is gibberlins. Next is gibberlins. Okay, this is also a growth hormone. It helps in shoot growth. Helps in shoot growth. And auxins help in apical growth from the apex. And gibberlins help from the shoot growth. And it is also the growth hormone. Okay. The next is cytokinin. Cytokinin means cell division. Its main function, it helps the cell. And it helps the cell in cell division. Okay. Cell divides and form the growth hormones. Okay. The cell divides. Cytokinin helps with the help of oxygen. These are interlinked. If there is no oxygen, the cytokinins, the cell will not divide or it will not perform its function. Fine. The fourth one is ethylene. The fourth one is ethylene. This hormone is the only hormone in gaseous state. So this is known as gaseous hormone. This is known as gaseous hormone. Okay, this is very important. And ethylene helps in ripening of the fruit. What is ripening of fruit? The fruit which helps in maturation. Okay, the banana first color is green then it ripes and it colors changes into yellow okay the next is abscisic acid or it is also known as aba or stress hormone okay it is known as stress hormone as 
it helps or perform its function when there is dehydration in plant there is loss of water in plant there is loss of water in plants then the abscessic acid perform its function it also helps in sensing of plants means aging of plants okay thylene also helps in aging of plants abscessic also helps to drop the leaves from the tree okay like leaves which get mature falls on the ground falling of the leaves okay is also function of abscessic acid so basically auxin gibberellin cytokinin and ethylene are growth hormones and this abscessic is growth inhibitor hormone this abscessic acid oppose all the functions done by the other hormones or phytohormones this is all about the phytohormones if you like my video hit the like button and subscribe my channel science all thank you